Hey guys, it's Gundidi here. And it's been a minute since I posted a long form in the office, so I figured I'd come back with a little bit of a bang. You know, with everything going crazy in the world right now, the thought of an apocalypse is definitely on everyone's mind. So, Canik kind of delivered. This is their new signature series. This one is called The Apocalypse. And it's kind of cool because it's got a like worn, torn finish on the slide, kind of makes it look rusty and old. And then on the frame, it's got that bronze finish with what looks like zombie blood all splattered across it. I mean, that is just really cool. Now, this is the Meta SF, uh, and you can see that biohazard uh, symbol right there on the uh, hood, I guess, of the barrel and then superior written across the top. But it is a Meta SF, so it is optics cut for a micro red dot. And of course you get the three dot sights that Canik is known for. Just like every other Canik, it's got that amazing trigger that Canik is known for. I mean, look at this reset. I mean, Canik is by far one of the best striker fire triggers out of the box. It's got a double undercut underneath the um, trigger guard, so you can get a nice good purchase without getting that Glock thumb knuckle or Glock knuckle that everyone knows of. And it's got a cool flared mag well to help with reloads on these 15 round magazines. And you can see that really cool flared mag well it makes putting those mags in super easy. Definitely something cool. Now, just like the standard Meta SF, it's got a four inch barrel. It's got that Glock 19 grip size. Uh, now it's got the double undercut. It's got a three slot Picatinny rail and it's got ambidextrous slide releases. And I believe the mag wells can change or the mag releases can change around too. So you lefties, this pistol is still available for you too. But I would be totally amiss if I did not show you everything that comes inside the box. I mean, just like the normal Canics, uh, they come with your uh, takedown tools, your cleaning tools, and a holster. This one's really cool because it is in the same color scheme as the frame and the slide. It's got that brown and gray. Really neat. And then, of course, your... Speed loader has got that bronze finish on it too. And your magwell has that zombie splattered slash uh, rusty finish on it. Kind of neat. But move over to the cool stuff. We got a signature series lighter. It is a Zippo lighter, uh, just standard Zippo. Uh, but it's cool. It's got that signature series and that rusty uh, decrepit look on there. And then we got this really cool like hatchet style knife. It is a fixed blade, but it's kind of fixed in this kind of position. Kind of cool for, uh, you know, taking out zombies. And you already came with some zombie blood on you. So, hey, what, in the, what the heck not? And then the blades got that weathered look like the slide does. Really neat, really cool looking. And then to top it all off, you got a signature series uh, badge custom uh, patch to throw on your gear and it's kind of got that rustic finish that's kind of got a shimmer shine to it kind of neat definitely something cool and you know of course Canik even though it's custom it's really really inexpensive for the amount of upgrades that you get this is definitely a really cool pistol and something you guys should definitely check out. It is the Signature Series Meta SF. This one is called the Apocalypse. And you know, with today's times, it kind of fits. You never know, but definitely something cool to check out. And guys, if you guys like that, definitely go ahead and hit a like and subscribe and comment in the comment section if you would get this Apocalypse Series. Definitely something cool. All right, guys, this is Gundidi, and I'll see you for the next one.